Hi everyone, welcome back. In this video, we're going to discuss some amazing projects made using ESP8266. So let's get started. Number 10. If you're looking for ways to send sweet messages outside of your smartphone to a friend, family, or partner, then you can use this ye old fax machine. It consists of a thermal printer inside that helps print out the messages sent from a smartphone. It receives messages using MQTT from your smartphone. So whether you're in the adjacent room or far from your home, you can send messages anytime just with a tap. A quill is placed outside the box, which moves back and forth from side to side, which makes the text look like it's written with a feather. Number 9. This project is a fun way to capture pests in your home with a high-tech trap. The IoT Live Trap uses an ESP8266 and a proximity sensor where you can control your traps with your phone. It has a motion detector that senses when something enters the trap and trips the door to close. All this can be seen right on your phone. What's more, it sends you a direct message on your phone that your trap door has been closed. Now that mouse is trapped and you can simply press the button on your phone to open the trap again and set it free out of your house. Number 8. Smart Solutions for Home just gave a new DIY project to feed our pets when we're not around or are too far away. The feeder is powered by a motor that spins to auger to distribute our pets food evenly into their bowl. Equipped with an ESP8266, the do-it-yourself pet feeder can be controlled with our phone. It seems quite simple, but you will require some programming skills and engineering skills. And with the press of a button, this pet feeder immediately rolls out the food for your pets on the go. Do you want to level up your game of PCB design by working on high-level PCB projects? If yes, then you should definitely check out Altium Designer. Altium provides functions for users with all levels of experience and requirements. And now with Octopart inclusion, you can get real-time component insights as you design your PCB in Altium. This can save your time as you can buy the part number directly from the Octopart website. Check the link given in the description for more details. Number 7. Having a smartwatch has its own benefits, right? But considering their high cost, one may simply turn down that idea. So why not make your own? By following this project, you can build a smartwatch for under $20. It easily connects to Wi-Fi and gives the time, date, and weather updates. But wait, that's not all. You can even control your home appliances just by tapping the watch. For this, you don't even have to be present there. If you have an internet connection, you can do it from any part of the world. Number 6. Lose your keychains a lot? Well, with this IoT-based project, you can find them in a matter of seconds with the sound of a ringing buzz. This do-it-yourself project simply needs an ESP8266 to connect to your phone, a buzzer to alert you, and a battery for it to function. So next time, if you lose your keys somewhere around your house, just press the button on your phone and the keychain finder immediately alerts you with a ring. It's a useful and practical project which you can easily program and build on your own. Number 5. If you're looking for some home automation ideas, you can start with this AC dimmer. The AC dimmer helps in controlling your light's functions by making them brighter or dimmer whenever you need to. And all of this from your phone. As you vary the slider widget on the Blink application, this changes the delay provided to the output, and hence a variable power is achieved at the output. In this way, you can control the light intensity very easily instead of just switching the bulb on or off. Interesting, right? Number 4. Do you need a quick reading of the weather without relying on a smartphone app? Well, this do-it-yourself project gives you the weather info by checking on temperature, humidity, and barometer pressure. 
It gets a reading every 10 minutes and uploads the data to a server called OceanBase. Using this, you can get more precise weather conditions around your area. It uses a Bosch BME280 temperature, humidity, pressure sensor, and a microchip ESP8266. It charts the weather updates for the past week that can be accessed from your laptop or PC. Number 3. Lighting crackers requires caution, but wouldn't it be amazing if you could light them from a safe distance, and that too, with your voice? Alexa, open ignition system. Launch the rocket. Launching rocket in. Three, two, one. Lift off. With this project, you can learn to build reusable rocket launchers with voice commands. You just need to order to Alexa from your phone, and the launch pad immediately lights up the fuse and gets your rocket up to the sky. What's amazing is that it is completely reusable. So when you want to light up another rocket, you would just need to connect the rocket again to the launch pad, get into a safe distance, then give the order to Alexa. Simply fun and safe. Number 2. This cool display has been designed using modular parts. These include acrylic sheets and 3D printed components that each character on the display is made from. You can choose how many of these you want depending on your needs. The parts are held together with a wooden frame so that it can be turned into a giant two-digit lap timer. This lets it receive a signal from a garage door key fob. Another application for it can be a timer for a local swimming pool. The buttons either reset the timer or start a three-stage countdown sequence that uses colors. Number 1. IoT-based projects are a great way to upgrade and minimize costs in the healthcare industry. This project is a patient health monitoring system that uses an ESP8266 and Arduino. The data collected is transmitted to your laptop or PC. The sensors check for a body temperature, pulse rate, and changes that occur over time. The pulse sensor is placed on the pointer finger of the patient and the data of their pulse as well as their body temperature gets transmitted and shown through charts. So if you need a less expensive monitoring system, you can buy one yourself with this cost-efficient, nifty project. So these were just some of the many cool projects made using ESP8266 and if you have more to say, make sure you leave a comment down below so we know what you think. While you're at it, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button to keep supporting us, and we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.